Okay, I'm Greg Vernovich, working for International Mountain Guides, and we've got a winter seminar set up here in the garage. Uh, all my gear, personal gear, and the group gear, uh, and food is all laid out here, and we'll go through it quickly uh, to make sure we have everything for a climb. Uh, right off of the Rainier Summit Climb gear checklist, a wicking t-shirt I have on, the base layer shirt uh, I have on, uh, underwear I have on, and then we'll go to a second layer, uh, a fleece, I have the R1 hoodie and my long underwear, followed by a soft shell top and bottom, uh, OR, both of those. Uh, next layer after that would be the down parka. Uh, since it's the winter seminar, I'm bringing two lightweight down parkas and down pants, lightweight down pants. Uh, sun hat, very important, followed with a wool beanie and a buff. Balaclava in case the weather really gets bad. Uh, lightweight liner glove and my leather glove with the emergency uh, cold glove for summer day if that happens. Three pairs of socks. My eating bowl and utensil, hot drink cup, and two Nalgene's. Then we have our Gore-Tex top and bottoms that we have to bring. Uh, it can get pretty windy uh, just on the Muir snowfield. Uh, then on top of my pack, I'll have all the extra things that I need, extra batteries, toothbrush, uh, some more batteries, my GPS, my map and compass, and extra GPS waypoints in a Ziploc bag, some toiletries, my fix-it kit consists of some rope, some tie wraps, a thermarest repair kit, some wire, and a small Leatherman. Also in the top of my pack, I'll put a sunblock, which I'll sleep with at night so it doesn't freeze, some hand warmers in case somebody's hands get cold, and my med kit. And glacier glasses will also go up there so I don't crush them. Uh, camera, knife, headlamp, goggles, and balaclava. For my boots, I'm going to wear a, a double plastic boot, uh, intuition liner, with my insert, uh, my blue Oslo boot, and my gaiters. My ice axe, my walking sticks, crampons, helmet, avi beacon, extremely important for the seminars, and my snowshoes. With my harness, uh, I have a lot of stuff going on here. And I have my ice screws, a figure eight, uh, my ATC harness, a couple other screws uh, because it was pretty hard up there and you never know what you're going to run into higher up. My ascender, some locking, non-locking, and big cordelette for, for teaching the crevasse rescue and setting up the fixed line. Uh, winter expedition pack uh, going with the did a uh, Mac loop by Gregory and have to have the big garbage bag to line the backpack with because we can get anything, rain, snow, all of it going on up there. Hey, let's get into the group gear. Bringing three stoves, eight ounces of white gas per person per day, uh, three stoves, gas, two cooking platforms, one extra gallon of fuel that will stay in my truck if need be. I have 40 wands for the route from Paradise up to Muir and higher if we need it. Um, cooking utensils. Two pots, one dipper cup. Cleaning utensils. Sponge, the rag, Purell, garbage bag, and a scrub brush. Condiments for eating, salt, pepper, Tabasco sauce, and olive oil. Blue bags, figure two per person. Uh, bring a few extra in case you get stuck down low. Two probes for teaching, 
one snow saw, three shovels, four pickets in case you get down low and to stake the tents and the mega mid down uh, for training purposes. We have some duffel bags, bungee cords, and the sleds. Uh, we'll teach the whole sled towing process down here at the headquarters and then we're going to practice it with a rope. We've got a short 35 meter rope that we're going to hook up and right out of paradise we're going to have the guys hook up to that and drag a sled. Uh, some snow anchors in here. It's good to teach the guys how to do that. And we have an EV3 tent that the clients can sleep in. And Aaron and I are planning on sleeping in the Mega Mid tonight. You can switch uh, and put, bring a Mega Mid and a tent and another tent, but we're going to cut down on the weight. Uh, food. We are going to be on the mountain six days, so five breakfast, five dinner. And there's a little bit of food up at Muir, but we're planning on carrying uh, everything with us. Probably leave a little bit in the truck in case we need to go back down. Like I said, plan for everything. That'll all go in stuff sacks. Hot drinks, cider, tea, hot chocolate, sugar, milk and coffee. A suit per night because everybody likes it and gets fluids in them. Hey, I think that's everything. We're ready to go play on Mount Rainier.